so we both just got done. We paid for our journey all the way from Pangan to Bangkok. Uh, pff, hang on, so I'm getting my phone up trying to work out what's happening here. And it's obviously what's happened is they've pulled over and let someone out and then they're just there trying to pull people out to try and make money. So today we go to Bangkok. We've decided to leave Koh Phangan. We've just booked our ticket. We're getting a ferry over to, is it Suratani? Yeah. Oh, it might be Suratani. Okay, it's Suratani. And then we've got to get a bus to the train station and then we get an overnight train. Altogether, it's about 18 or 19 hours. It's quite a lot. Um, it's costing us about 30 pounds each, which is obviously really good for like 18, 19 hours. We're gonna get to Bangkok at 9.30 a.m. tomorrow. 9.30 a.m. tomorrow we'll arrive in Bangkok. And at the moment it's about, what, 11 o'clock in the morning the day before. So yeah, we've got a long old journey ahead of us. Um, this is us packing. We've been in this room now for about eight days. So we've been here ages. We've just got to Consola here, waiting for our ferry to Surat Thani. It's our ticket. Time to check in for our ferry. It's hot. It's going to be so hot in Bangkok. Get stickers. Stick <laughs> to know where we're going. Make sure we're on the right ferry and train. Yeah. <laughs> so we got our train tickets and our bus tickets to the train station and our ferry ticket. So we're going to Unsac City. Hear they got enough dogs. You're at. Fuming. Absolutely fuming. So we've noticed in Kotal Kopangang that the dogs are angry. Really angry. In Kopangang they're a lot better. In Kotal they're quite aggressive. Yeah, I don't know it's what it is. There's only a couple here that have been ag. They just bark a lot and just look really angry and like intimidating. We are on the ferry. These rough seats take up the whole aisle. I'm safe. Where are we going? Where did we come up? Down that way. Can't remember. It needs to be quick, don't we? to go there they was like yeah and I was like what is it is it the train station and then I was like we were trying to work it out like Surat Tani is where we need to go but there's so many names you're trying to remember right it's, anyway within all the confusion because they're very like rushy here you, you, you've really got to stop and think right there's these two guys like shouting at the door directly in front of us like oh come then like basically saying like we don't know if they, we they work for the company, the company yeah because Whenever you stop anywhere, there's people there automatically to pick your bags up, take you straight to the next thing. It's very well organised normally, so to, to believe that it's just randomers 
is obviously quite tough but obviously when you got your earphones in you're in a different world and yeah whatever anyway so we've got off i've gone to stand by the uh the van door to get our bags out and they've gone our wait so obviously the guy and the cars then opened the bags because they obviously didn't have a key but i didn't really think anything of it so we're waiting there outside the road and he's like oh 300 baht per person which is something like seven pound each to take us like a half an hour journey to the train station i was like no it's included, included in the in price i've paid it. for it and they're like no no you gotta pay for it blah, blah, blah. i was like hang on so i'm getting my phone up trying to work out what's happening here and it's obviously what's happened is they've pulled over and let someone out and then they're just there trying to pull people out to try and make money we should have stayed in the minivan but within all the confusion we're in our own worlds not really thinking about it and we fell for it so we ended up having to get out but just managed to get a grab which is a way cheaper option than tuk tuks and stuff like that you just got on your phone and go and grab so they didn't, I didn't actually give them any money no, but it still cost us an extra like £5.50 But it's still not too bad We're in a taxi with the man now so. But, you know, it's easily done It's so hard You have to be on your toes Be wary all the time. Things like that Luckily we managed to sort this one out But it's very hard Normally I'm on my phone looking at the map Seeing exactly where we are So I know, okay, we're really close I can get off here But I was literally on my phone And so was like Bangkok And I was like, okay, come on then Didn't really think of it it's right fault, but you know, live and learn. Very easily done though. Just watch out out there. Be safe. Forty baht. It's forty baht. Yeah. Do you want one? Yeah. Um. At the train station, getting some food. Just make sure mine's not spicy. Is it chicken? Yeah, chicken. That's chicken. After that flava, we're at the train station, so yeah. Oh, yeah. We're going to calm down now. After nearly being scammed. Oh, we did get scammed. <laughs> Well, no, we didn't give the man money. We got in a grab.
basically, yeah. I think I probably could go cheaper, but just got here. I want to get my bearings, got bags on us. Sometimes it's easier just to pay the 100 baht each and just get to your hotel. How much would you 100 baht each. 200 baht for the fix, 25 minutes, so it's not bad. But I think if you've got a grab, it really is a lot cheaper. But at the same time, when you just get somewhere, you've got bags on you, if you're happy just to pay a certain amount, just, just pay that. Is it it's cheaper here? Is it cheaper here than I think so. the island? Because yeah, well, so. here they've got competition, so it's either on Meetar, which is cheap anyway, Grab, obviously Bolt I think is here as well, which is another company, and obviously got Tuk Tuk. Whereas on the island, sometimes it's just one company and they run it, so it doesn't matter, you never get a cheap price like 100 baht just to go anywhere, minimum. But here you can get a journey for like 40 baht, 30 baht. And obviously you can also get trains here as well, so We'll get used to the price difference, right? Yeah. We just need to get used to it. But yeah, like I say, just pay a bit more maybe just to get there. Yeah. But yeah, so we just got off the coach, into the taxi, and we'll be at our hotel soon. A very long journey. <laughs> yeah. You stuff your face with wrinkles. <laughs> Hotel. Got a plus one. Makes a check. No. Uh, we're checking in. Check in. Yeah. Okay. Okay. What can we do about bags? Yes. May I have your passport, please? Yeah. I look a mess right now. No, they're gorgeous. We've been traveling for so long. They're gorgeous. Um, just got to our hotel about 10 minutes ago. Can't check into the two, so we've got a few hours left yet. So just come to find some food. 50 baht each. Very cheap. Very cheap. Yeah, it's like a little. There's a Burger King right there, though. I really did want a Burger King, but it was good. Gonna get an iced coffee, too. And we can check in at two. Gonna go see what else there is to do around here. Yeah. And we'll be back. Oh, no, it's Thank you. Cold, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so we're finally checking into our room, um, our hotel in Bangkok. We've had a, a break from the hostels, fancy treating ourselves, so this is our room. Very fancy. Bottle of Sang Sum there. Big TV. Nice bed. Nice decor, very fancy. This is a new hotel, isn't it? It's a new hotel, look at this. Very nice bathroom. Can you see through? I think it's frosted. Can you see me? Go back. Oh, it's so foul. Yeah, you can see you if you put your head there. Hmm, very nice. Very posh. Very posh. It's only like twenty pound a night as well. It's not even that much. It's twenty, 20 pound a night. night for this. There's a rooftop pool and everything. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Coke, Sprite. It says the price of it though. <laughs> Got some beer. Got some beer. Yeah, wouldn't it be good if this was included? Thank you for watching our video. If you'd like to follow our journey, make sure you hit that like button, comment below, and subscribe to our channel. And if you'd like to be notified each time we post, then make sure you have the notification bell turned on below.